Hey there, everybody. It's Mr. Cherry with Cherry's Quest number two. Number dose. So, uh, here we are, and, uh, as you can see, I've made quite a few differences, a little different things here and there, uh, since the last video. I made nice, myself a nice little farm here. Um, there's water underneath these, uh, half blocks, um, from this little lake. And, uh, I dug a little bit down here, kind of found my way into, like, a little dungeon. I haven't decided uh, if I wanted to go and explore it too much yet. It seems pretty far down. Not really ready to do that just yet, so we're going to go ahead and head upstairs here. And uh, I'll show off the house just a little bit. It's nothing special. I didn't do much different here. I put up glass. I got a little sugarcane farm, which uh, needs to get sugarcaned. I don't know if that's a real way to say that, but uh, I'm going to. So, yeah, that works for me right there. A little kitty taking a bath over there, it looks like. Um, let's see, I got a little ladder that goes up to the top part of the area. So it's just a little easier on me to get to. And over here, I have working on a different mine shaft that I figured might as well build inside the house. Uh, back here is just a room. I have to decide what I want to do. And I finally turned this into a bedroom. As you can tell, it's just a bed and in a room before it's a bedroom. And, uh, yeah, I made a little sky roof so I can always keep a track on the time. Uh, so anyways, let's see here. Uh, what do we got to actually play with? We got some glass. You know, I'm gonna go ahead... I'm gonna head over to this village because I did promise I'd go over that way. So let's go check out this village and, uh, go see if we can help them out a little bit with something. Because usually these villages always need, um some type of material, and it's not difficult to get the materials, it can be kind of annoying, but, uh, you can do it. So what do we got here? Is this like a little pig ranch? It looks like one. A little horse. A little watchtower, some birds. It looks nice. Looks for that, it's kind of weird looking. That bird's kind of annoying, isn't he? I'm gonna kill it next time I see it. Alright, let's head up here. Uh, what is this place called? Vax Leoshan Village Meltier Population 10 So what do we got here? They need glass. They have wood. You can see what they're trying to construct and you can see what they need. And you can right click it and just get more information that way if you wanted to or... So I guess this is a military area. But I can look at the whole map of the of the place if I wanted to, or see the population, things like that. Anyways, uh, you can sell to them, like glass, like like they need glass right now, so we'll go ahead and sell them some glass, I don't need it. I'll sell them some cobblestone too, just to be kind of nice, because uh, it's not that I don't need it, it's just that uh, I want to be nice. And then they give you money, which is uh, here, it's like a uh, silver thing. Um, I don't really think I need anything that they have. One of the summoning would be nice. But I need to be one of them in order to do it. I need to get the rip my reputation up for that. Which I don't have, so I just I'm kinda stuck without it. Anyways, uh, I did that, so now they have glass as you can see, so they're gonna go construction or use construction to work on that. Probably soon. In fact I would imagine that building being built by the time I come back, if I even come back. But that's kind of a nice little feature about this uh, mod, is that you can kind of check out stuff. Now, where is my house? Way over there. Okay. Alright, and there's also big old towers around the area. I can't, I haven't seen one yet, but when I do, I'm definitely going to go investigate it, because uh, those have treasures and stuff in them, and I like my treasure. So I'm going to have to go exploring the world a bit. Probably will do that soon. I'll probably make a beacon or something out of this house. I think that's the best way to do it. So that way I can always find it again. Um, I got a deer stuck on my pond. Okay, well, we got some wheat ready to go, but I'm not going to go ahead and pick it up just yet. Um, in fact, let's go ahead and make that beacon, I think. I think that's a smart move, is making a beacon. We don't really have much, though, uh, in terms of making a beacon. Hmm... I guess what I could do is just make a big old tower with some torches on it. It's kind of just an idea. Um, let's go ahead and just do that. We'll just build it right here. Just kind of build it as high as we can get it. Up, 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 up. I think that's big enough. We'll just kind of place torches around it like so. 
All right. Oh god, don't kill me. And it killed me. <laughs> so I died already. First death. Um, thank God this isn't hardcore mode. The nice thing about this mod is that you actually keep your items when you die. So it's not it's not the biggest problem. Oh, it's getting nighttime. I'm gonna grab my XP real quick, and then um, then then we'll go ahead and go to sleep, and then we'll we'll go we'll go adventuring. I think that's pretty smart. To sleep it till it's day, so yeah, I don't have to worry about any ghost or something. <laughs> All right. So we got our sword of ironness, because it's, it's an iron sword. Um, actually, I want to keep that tree there. It looks kind of cool, just kind of there. Um, I'll just probably keep this little forest right now. Uh, oh, we got a big open plains area. Looks like kind of marshy, isn't it? Can I see that beacon? Yes, I can. Okay. Um, okay, we got plenty of torches. What the hell? Where are you? You die now. You make too much noise. No! You make me look like a fool on the interwebs! Ha! <laughs> Got him. Oh, there's another one. I gotta get that one, too. There we go. Mission complete. Alright, I'm just gonna kind of put torches down here and there. Just so it's easier for me to find my way back if need be. I just kind of want to go exploring without getting lost, preferably. Because I won't lie, I get lost easily. Hey, look, a fox. Nah, I won't kill it. It can stay alive. All right. Hmm. I'm not absolutely sure where to go. Um, there's a lot of stuff to explore, so I'm just gonna kind of go around here and see what happens. Uh, this place is like an open area of some sort, or kind of like a quarry. <laughs> kind of. Very similar to one. Put a torch down. Let's see. Yeah, I'm pretty far away from the norm. Let's see. Something going on in here, it looks like. Uh, bad rats, it looks like. Yep. Yep. Let's just kill them real quick. Let's see. Zombie. Ouch. <laughs> gym thing. I'm not so sure what those do either. It's just something I'm going to have to kind of play around with until I figure stuff out. Alright, I'm going to go back so I don't get lost here, because I will get lost, guys. I have a terrible sense of direction. At least I can still see my tower, so that, that worked out. I still have my beacon up. And I have torches laying around, so I know I'm in my general vicinity of knowing of where to be. So, that's good to know. Um... Seems to me that that's always the best way for me how I play games like this. Uh, I always have to have some type of landmark or beacon for me to kind of run back to so I don't lose my track. You know, you guys may just be like, oh, I know how Minecraft World works like. I know where I build my place and know where I am at all times. I always have problems with finding my house after I build it and stuff. So I always like to leave little markers and stuff for me to remember to go. Okay. I'm gonna cut down this tree. It's kind of in the way. Oh my. A little junk. Ow! That freaking hurts! What is that? Ow! Screw you! Die! Evil being! Ah! Ow! Okay. Can't get me up underneath a tree. Tree's the safe zone. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, right. I ain't gonna win this fight. Ow! Did it leave me alone? I think so. Alright. Okay. Well. Still no, still no big awesome tower things. World's still kind of loading in. Hmm. Oh, you jerk! Oh, that's it. I got you. I got your number. Let's do this. Let's do this. Yeah, I got yeah. What did you give me? Sweet. All right. Um, I guess I'm gonna head back for now. I got some more stuff I want to try to mine out. 
Ah, there's a torch. See? Love having a torch because it always gives me a chance to kind of go, my house is in this direction. There it is. There's the beacon right there. So that's my way of keeping track of where I am in the world at all times. And that was not a pig. That's what uh, most people like to refer to it as a bear. Or a bear. Or a bar. Or something. Hey, look a cow. Dead cow. Hey, look a pig. Still a live pig that's now dead. And a chicken. That's not a duck. I wanted to say duck. Every time I see a chicken, I always want to say duck. I don't know why. They look like ducks. I think most people can agree with that. And there's another bunny. Bunny, 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 bunny. Come here, bunny. 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 Come here. No, don't put the ladder down, retard. Ha! <laughs> bunny on my face. I uh, has a bunny hat. Bunny, bunny. There we go. That's what I wanted. I wanted to dash. Ah, it's hard to dash. Yeah. I screwed that up terribly. I has bunny hat. Most people are envious of my bunny hat, by the way. Okay. So now we're back at home. Alright. Open door! No, bunny, don't die! It's okay, bunny. It's gonna be alright. Don't. Ah! Bunny! Bunny, stop it. Okay, you're scaring me. I don't want you to die. It's okay, you're in a hole now. The chances of me accidentally hitting you with my pickaxe are pretty much next to none. Did you... You're making weird noises. Ah, what is... Okay, you're making weird noises. I'm gonna have to murder you if you keep making weird noises. Oh, hey, coal. You can always do a more coal. But yeah, this has been pretty exciting so far. It's been a pretty good map. Uh, the hardest part I'm having right now, honestly, is, um... Actually, those are just rats, I think. Rats falling out of a tree. Hardest part I'm having is actually finding, like, dungeons. That's what I'm looking for right now, aside from the one that was in another hole. Because it was a very, very deep dungeon. Like, it was just kind of like a hole going straight down. And that's not the kind of dungeon I like looking for. I like looking for, uh, more bigger open terrain ones. Because it's just easier to, um, handle and get through. This bunny seems to be having a good time. He's just kind of hopping around, being like, Yep, I'm the boss. You're making this hole for me. I mean, don't lie, we all know you are. In which cases, uh, in which most cases, uh, he's uh, he's not right at all. But uh, we'll let him, we'll let him be right. There's another game I gotta, I gotta try playing. It's called Towns. You guys, if you watch the Yogcast or you know uh, Sips at all on YouTube, he uh, he does it. He does a, a big old series of towns, and that game is a lot of fun. And I picked it up, so I'm gonna I'm gonna do some videos on it. It's it's pretty fun and entertaining to watch. You know? So uh, yeah, I'm probably gonna end up doing that. If you haven't checked it out yet, go ahead and uh, look him up. Watch his stuff because it's really fun to watch. It's something that kind of got me hooked onto it. In fact, the Yogg's Cast really got me hooked onto Minecraft. So it's just kind of one of those things. Everyone likes the Yogg's Cast. Um, so uh, a lot of fun. Okay, this bunny really is asking to get hit, isn't he? He's just like, don't leave me! Don't do it! And I'm like, I, I have to, I have to dig. Because I, I like to dig. I really do. Like, I find digging one of those ways to release stress. Do I not have another pickaxe? I guess not. I have an iron one that I was kind of waiting on using, but... We'll use it until probably about halfway and then make a stone one. No reason not to. Move! Move, bunny! Move! You're in the way. Your cuteness cannot last you a lifetime. Did it just die? Or I think those are the rats. So I think we're getting close to a dungeon. So... I'm actually going to start digging straight, I think, and see where we get. But they might be above me, which is, would be funny, really. That's what it would be. 
that the bunny? No. It's rats, man, but they sound really, really freaking close. Alright, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna go to where I think they are and go, like, right about up here. And just kind of dig straight. Let me see if I run into one. Ah, see? It's like I know what I'm talking about, guys. It's like I know what I'm talking about. Oh, God, they are here. Here's the rats. Found them. Oh, jeez. They're small. Small little buggers. And I am hungry. Oh, Jesus, rat! Ah! And here comes the zombie. Perfect timing, zombie. Alright, I need some chicken. Delicious chicken. Ugh, oh, God. Well, I found the annoying rat noises. So that's cool. Ah, stupid zombie. Back up. Alright, zombie is officially backed up. Iron. Seems kind of irony, huh? To mine my iron, iron with iron, it's kind of ironic. Ah, uh, anyone? Anyone for the pun? Eh, it's alright, you guys don't have to like my crappy puns. In fact, I, I, in fact, I wouldn't blame you if, you if you hated me for that. That It's kind of lame, but... Uh, it was difficult not to resist because it's just, you know, iron, irony. Okay, fine. You know what? I'm sensing grasshoppers from the crowd. I'm just gonna, just gonna go with it and move on. Um, so, wow, let's let's down here. Hmm, nothing, nothing is down here. In fact, we're gonna go ahead and just leave these away. Looks like just iron was down there. I'm taking these with me. I can just stay a dark hole. Hopefully I'll remember that. Watch, I'll come back and I'll probably go down there like, What's down there again? Oh, coal? Ah, skeleton. Ah, God, you have a good shot! Screw you, buddy! Ugh. I hate skeletons that are good at shooting arrows. Okay. Well, this doesn't look very, uh treacherous at all. Let's go ahead and just kind of mine this out. More iron. Wow, big iron deposit here. Might look there'll be a creeper coming up on me. Okay. dungeon, her cave thing, it really is not acting very cave-like. Oh, sorry for you got here, buddy. Ooh. Don't mean to yawn on you. I'm not bored. I'm just... Just kind of just woke up, so my brain is not exactly brain-like right now. It's just kind of... just kind of feel there right now, you know? I've got horses above me somewhere. More iron. I think there's some lava but over here. Oh no, it's a little cave. And we got a ghost above me. Awesome. You know, these ghosts are really freaky. I really dislike the the uh, voice cachet for them. Why couldn't they just be happy Barney songs? I don't know, that'd be pretty creepy too. Could you imagine that? That'd be really creepy. Oh, it's getting really loud, guys. I'm kind of freaking out about it. A little louder than I feel like it should be. But hey, iron. Iron's cool. Alright, in fact, uh, I think I'm gonna go head up back to the house and uh, cook some of this iron. This iron's kinda begging to be cooked. In fact, let's grab some more coal for that. Freaking ghosts. Alright, so we gotta find our way back. Oh, Jesus. Okay, it was back here. Okay, see, I probably went over. I'll probably do that a lot because I get lost easy. Again, no sense of direction, guys. Um, so I do apologize for any dumb moves I may make, and you guys will probably make fun of me. Probably never let it go, but that's okay. One second here. Alright. 
Please tell me I closed the front door. Ha <laughs> ha! I'm not an idiot. I have a unicorn out there. Mr. Skeleton, there's a unicorn out there. It's right there. I see it. I see it. Yeah, whatever. Okay, let's go ahead and put some coal in here. And let's go ahead and put in our iron. And let's go ahead and call it a night because there are enemies all over the place. Quite scared of the enemies. Don't like them. They can go screw off, go do something else. The unicorn is still there. I'm going to go check him out. Hopefully, nothing wants to eat me. Which, of course, when I say that, everything wants to eat me. Oh, God, why? Alright. We're alive. For now. Let's go check out this little... Oh, God, there's the ghost! <laughs> Mr. Cherry, the Ghostbuster. The creeper up there. That's why I'm gonna run my plants with this unicorn. Hello, unicorn. Hello. Hi. My name is Mr. Cherry. And I'll be trapping you! <laughs> There's nothing you could do. You can't stop me! I'm a madman with bricks. No! No, you get back in your home! You get back in your home. Right there. That's your home. It is your home. You're my unicorn. Mine. Nobody else's. <laughs> unicorn. Now you will be stuck there for eternity. Or until I decide to figure out how I'm gonna make you like me more. Which I'm not so sure how you make unicorns like you. Uh. Any of these uh, trees want to give me an apple? That's one of the ways you can do it. Oh, hush. You're in there for a reason. Because you're going to be my new pet. My new pet unicorn. Uh, these things are dropping apples. Like I was hoping they would. Apples. I think, well, it seems like... I know horses like apples. Um, I've actually... Well, I haven't personally owned a horse, but my mother has. So I've grown up around horses. So I guess, theoretically, I have owned a horse, but not really. So yes, I, I know how horses act. I know that they like apples for the most part. So... At least they always liked it when I gave an apple to a horse, so... Yeah. We're gonna, we're gonna try it and see what happens. Kind of makes sense. All right. Okay. Let's go see if this horse will eat some apples with me. Ha! Ah, it worked. I didn't even know it would. Um, Sir Pinkerton. Sir Pinkerton. Sweet. Come on out, Sir Pinkleton. You may. Come on. I have a I have a room for you in my house actually. Come on. Come, Sir Pickington. You are bouncing like a madman. Come with me. Come with me. We have to find you a saddle. You'd be so amazing with a little saddle. Ah I have a unicorn pet. This is epic. A unicorn pet that doesn't want to follow me. Do you want the apple? Nom 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 nom. I'll eat it in front of you. I already chose my name, Sir Pinkington. That's his name, Sir Pinkington. Come, unicorn. Come. I have a place for you to stay. Yes, that's the way. There. No, this way. Come on. Come on, no, Sir Pinkerton. Why are you being so disrespectful? You're a unicorn. You're the last of your kind. I'm trying to save you. Yes, Sir Pinkerton. Oh god, Sir Pinkerton! Look out, there's lions! Mountain lions, to be exact, because they're on a mountain! Oh god, the mountain lion What's my baby! Sir Pinkerton, save me! Sir Pinkerton, why aren't you saving me? <laughs> You're a terrible, terrible pet. Oh god, Sir Pinkerton, doing the crops. Yes, I got his butt in my face, go. Keep going, Sir Pinkerton. We're almost home. The door's wide open. You can do it. 
You could do it, Sir Pinkerton. I believe in you. You're not going to get any fresh sunshine for a little while. You're going to be okay. It's going to be okay. Come on. Come on. No, where are you going? You're supposed to go in the house. No. Sir Pinkerton, you're going to die out here. I swear to you. Sir Pinkerton? I'm getting scared. Why aren't you obeying me? Up, Sir Pinkerton. Up. Uh, uh, get in the house. No. In the house, you stupid horse. With a horn on its head. This way. This way. Stop resisting the house. I will disown you. Come on. Come on. There we go. Oh, come on now. You're going the completely wrong way, Sir Pinkerton. Sir Pinkerton. Oh, God. He's on top of the house. No. Hmm. I will be right back. And I'm back. And, uh, I kind of cheated. Got myself some saddles, because, uh, Sir Pinkerton's mine. Can I... Can I not put one on you? Sir Pinkerton? Oh, crap! No, Sir Pinkerton! I love you! Don't... Don't run away. Don't be scared. It's okay. Shh, 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 shh. Eat some apples. Uh, why can't I ride Sir Pinkerton? Ugh! <laughs> I will... <laughs> no, I want to ride Sir Pinkerton. Wait. I, I thought you could only have one saddle and one stack. Hold on. Hooah! Eh, maybe not. Maybe you can have eight to a stack. Sir Pinkerton, I want to ride you. I want to ride these. See, Sir Pinkerton. Ah, oh, screw you, Sir Pinkerton. You had your chance. You had your chance, and then you blew it. You blew it! My house now. All to myself. Lonely. Forever alone. <sighs> Sir Pinkerton, I'm sorry. It's lonely. Yeah, that's alright. Okay. So, now that that shenanigans is over, uh, what can we do now? In fact, you know, I think, I think that's a pretty good way to end. Oh, Jesus. Hello, friend. Hi. Did I kill your mom? You know what? I'm gonna fix it. There, fixed. I'm not so sure how that fixed anything, but, um... Sir Pinkerton's gonna kind of chill out out here. He likes, uh, the air. Um, apparently he's my pet. Which doesn't make much sense, because he's not acting like one very much. Um, he's just kind of doing his own thing. He's more like a cat pet. Like a real cat. You know, he's just kind of like, screw you. I, this is my house. Do what I want. Yeah. Sounds like Sir Pinkerton to me. Jerk. Jerk horse. I try to get a saddle for it. Doesn't even respect me. Ugh. Ugh. God. Frustration. Oh, very. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and do some stuff off camera like before and uh, hopefully I'll find something interesting. Anyways, I'll see you guys next time on Team Cherry Corp. You guys take it easy and I will see you around. Bye-bye.